Hi guys, so today I'm doing a video just me getting ready to go to my sister's wedding dress fitting. So if you want to watch me do this look, um, I don't know if you can tell how much glitter I have on. Um, yeah, keep watching. And if you like it, please subscribe and like it if you want to. Okay. Okay, so I'm just starting off with uh, freshly washed hair, just putting all my normal products in. I have a couple hair videos showing what I do. And Bo did something stupid, but I started off using the Yes to Care Nourishing Daily Facial Moisturizer all over. And then I go in with the Lumi Glotion by L'Oreal in the shade Fair Glow. And then I'm just getting everything I'm trying to use. There's the Lumi Glotion. Glotion. That's a weird word. And I'm looking for things again. And I'm taking the CoverGirl and Olay Simply Ageless Foundation with sunscreen in it. SPF 28. Instant Wrinkle Define. It's in the shade 205 Ivory. It's the one that comes in the little pot. And I'm using the PH Cosmetics sponge. It's the black one. Specifically, the black one. I tried the purple one. It's just, it's, it's bad. It soaks everything up. It's really hard. Just don't waste your money on that. Get the black one. I like the black one. Oh, it's doing something stupid again. So now I'm just taking Shape Tape in Fair Beige. Just kind of just putting it everywhere I need it to be. And I'm using it as an eyelid primer too. Using that same sponge to blend everything out. There is an ant here. And then I'm going to take Fit Me Loose Powder um, by Babeline in 05 Fair. And I don't bake really, I just kind of press it into the skin with a sponge. And I kind of just do it where I would crease. And I'm also doing some cream contouring with the LA Girl Pro Conceal HD Eye Definition Concealer in the shade Chestnut. This did not turn out as well as I thought it would. Ignore that. And most brushes I am using are either Wet n Wild or BH Cosmetics. That's me looking for the shade. Okay, so then I'm setting my face with the Milani Prep Set and Glow O2 Illuminating Transparent Powder. It is not transparent. Do not believe that. I was taking a BH Cosmetic brush from that Chrome collection. Just putting it everywhere. Getting my Shade and Light Palette. And taking the two lighter shades on a Wet n Wild Angle Brush and just doing some light contouring. And then I'm doing my nose with some random ass brush. I think it's one wild from a million years ago. Taking a Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer, it's completely broken. On another BH Cosmetics brush, this is the one that can't, comes in like the little brush holder. And this one's two out of that collection. I really like the brushes. Taking some Beauty Gems Blush Palette. I'm not really exactly sure what brand this is. I think it's technically by Ulta. I gotta take a couple different shades from here because the first one I put on didn't do what I wanted it to do. So, yeah. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and put some more stuff in my hair, brush it out, and then blow dry it. I am using the Con Air Infinity Pro Hot Air Paddle Brush. I have a review on that brush. Bo is doing something, as always. Yeah, I only kind of filmed, I cut out a lot of 
the uh, part that I have filmed of me just doing my hair. <sighs> but I'm just blow drying it out. And I section it up into two sections. Top section and bottom section. Where are these ants coming from? <sighs> also, do you guys like my grandma on my nightgown? I got it from the Goodwill outlet. Did I say that already? I don't know, it was like 20 cents. Okay, now I'm taking the Chocolate Gold Palette by Too Faced. And the first shade I'm taking is going to be so bougie. I'm going to put that in my crease. Then I'm going to define my crease a little bit more with Cocoa Truffle. And then I'm going to take a tiny bit of the black shade called Decadent in the outer corner. And the shade I'm going to be putting on my lid is called Famous. And I just put that on my finger. And then halfway through me putting that on, I kind of put a little bit of a gold dip up there too. So it kind of ends up being gold dip mixed with Famous. And that is on the lid. Wow. Mimi. Me, me. me. My cat is meowing. She can't meow properly. She's also going blind. Yeah, there's me putting the famous and gold dip to put my eyelid. I like to use these shades with my finger. And I'm going to be taking a, I don't even know what kind of brush it is, uh, taking money bags, putting that on my lower lash line. I start off with this brush and then I go in with a um, pencil brush that is by BH Cosmetics and then I follow that with an Urban Decay, Urban Decay Moon Dust kind of messed up in Zodiac Taking Star Crush Minerals uh, glitter with called Beginner Luck with the NYX Glitter Glue and putting that underneath my eyeballs. For some reason, I started doing this, um, putting glitter on my lower lash line. I don't know why I do it. I think it looks a lot better with actually without um, color four. The color already put down. I think it was better when it's just the glitter. But yeah, the Star Crush Minerals. What did I say it was called? Beginner Lock. Okay, and then this is just the Clinique. Um, pretty easy liquid eyeliner pen. I got this in a Sephora Play Box. It's full size. Um, yeah, I know you guys can't really fucking see what I'm doing because it's bad. I can't do eyeliner without being like right up in the mirror. And then I'll be tight lining with the Marc Jacobs shit what is that called? Marc Jacobs Highliner. And then taking an angle brush with the black shade out of the palette and just going over everything I just did. I'm using the Marc Jacobs mascara. I don't know what kind it is. It's a another sample I got at Sephora Play. It's like the best eyeliner ever. But I don't think I'd ever buy a full size of it because it's so fucking expensive. Okay, yeah, then my dad came in my room, 
and scared my bird and he's sort of flying everywhere and I had to cut a lot of it out. Okay, I'm taking the BH Cosmetics Spotlight Highlight. This is like such a fucking great highlighting power palette. I take the white one and the pink one, the lighter pink one, and just do some highlighting. Yes, me. I see you. I'm just using a uh, e.l.f. small table or tapered brush for that. I'm kind of just blending everything back together with that. Ah! Powder for. Oh, I put some lip balm on. and then go to straighten my hair. Hair straight. Taking a little bit of this Melted Matte by Too Faced. It's the green one, I do not know what the shade is called. Okay, so that's it. That is the whole get ready with me type thing. Um, old fashioned YouTube style. So, again, if you like it, please subscribe and give my video a like. I'm trying to get up there on the radar. Bye, guys.